to Nilu's Healthy Cooking. Today I am making green salsa which has been used for making enchilada with green sauce and you can have that with tortilla chips also. And it's very easy, simple and delicious. So let's see how we make it. For making green sauce, what we need is, these are tomatilla, that's a green tomato. And I have taken medium size, round about 10 to 12. And these are my very fresh, you can just peel it, I have peeled it like this. It's very, very fresh. And wash it. So this is, I have to wash this one. And these are all washed. And you can take jalapeno. This you can take as much spicy you want. For this, I am taking three. Just only two cloves of garlic and very little, only this much of onion to give the thickness to the sauce. And some fresh cilantro. So this is the only thing what we need. So now let's start the procedure. In a pan, I'm taking some water. I'm not taking much because we don't want too much of liquidy. Okay, and that just remove the stem part of jalapeno. Okay, you can just cut it with the knife. Just like this. I'm cutting it. Just take jalapeno inside. So two and three. So I have removed the stem part. And this is what we first want, jalapeno and onion and garlic so first for five minutes we are going to boil this because tomato doesn't take long time to get cooked so now i'm covering it and let it give a boil for about seven to eight minutes okay I did it for about 5 to 6 minutes and now the jalapeno has become half cooked. So now this is the time we add all tomatillo. And put it on the high flame now. And we are not going to overcook tomatoes. We don't want to break our tomatoes. So now we have to cook it. So now we will cook our tomato. It will change a color once it starts getting cooked. So once it changes the color, we'll put off the flame. Because we don't want it to break inside. Okay, so let it cook now. So now let's check our tomatoes. And I had already covered it to boil. And let's see. Okay, see now do you see that the tomato has become now little yellowish. So we don't want to overcook it. So this is done. Now put off the flame and allow it to cool down. So now we are blending it. So first I will take a jalapeno inside. Jalapeno, take it and then taking garlic. This is a garlic side and onion. So let's take onion. Okay. And first take some water from it and blend this part first. Okay. I'm taking water from this. And now let's blend it. So in this pulp now we are taking tomatoes. Okay, so we can take little, little because I cannot blend all at a time. Okay, so first let me do this much. Okay, so let's do it. So now I can add rest of it inside. And you saw that how little water I had taken and I used all the water also inside because it all gets a good flavor. Now this much is left and I will take this water also. Right. 
like so. Got everything inside. And this is the cilantro. It's already been washed. So now I am adding it into this. So let's mix everything perfectly. Okay, now once again blend it. So in our this green salsa, I'm adding these three ingredients, salt to taste as much you require, okay, salt to taste, some oregano, not too much, I will be just taking only quarter of a teaspoon, okay, so some oregano, okay, and some black pepper okay that's it nothing else because we are as it is going to get a good flavor of onion and garlic green sauce is ready Looks so good and fresh and getting very good aroma because it's still hot and now I am very eager to try first. It's really yummy <clears throat> but I will, would like to say one thing. If you don't eat too much spicy, then instead of three jalapeno in this ingredients, you take two. Okay, so I have taken three and of course I am feeling it spicy. But I am going to use it on tacos and everything. So that's absolutely perfect for me. So our green salsa is ready. And now I am going to, this you can use it for tacos and chilada. And if you want to eat it with the chips, tortilla chips or any other chips, I'm showing you that also. It's very easy. What you need for it is one avocado. Okay, so break it like this into two parts. Break it into two parts like this. Open it. Okay. And just scoop it. So I'm scooping avocado like this. Okay, so it's been done and just break it. You do. Okay, so I have already mashed it and once you mash it, just add one or two drops of lime juice so it doesn't get black color and pinch of salt just for avocado. Just pinch of salt and in this add some green salsa which we have already made okay so this you can use it for your dip it's really tastes too good so this has become very nice like a guacamole okay and you can have it as a dip tastes so good Right, and I have it. This is my organic corn tortilla. It's made from yellow corn and purple corn. So we will be having this in our tea time today. I would love to try now. It's real yummy. Please do try. And as I, as you see, this green salsa, you can use it for tacos, enchilada, deep. It's fresh, homemade stuff. You will love eating it. We have two things today. Green salsa and dip. 
So thank you for watching and check my other recipes.